Hey everybody, Grimer here coming at you from a free-to-play game. Now, I found out about this game just recently, but apparently it's been out for a little bit, and I just wanted to try it out because I normally uh, I don't normally don't get pumped for free-to-play games, you know. They're all right. They can provide some good entertainment, but this one right here kind of caught my eye because it looks fantastic. All right, this is called Deathly Stillness, okay? And this was created by a guy, uh, a grand total of seven, uh, 17 days, I think, if you look at the description. It actually uh, took him to make this. In fact, if you look at the, uh, the description uh, the developer provides for it right here, it says, This is a boring third-person zombie game with no plot. Complete the quest to kill all the zombies. Uh, not a, an officially released game. And yet, with almost 10,000 reviews, it's got an o overwhelmingly positive score. Further on down the Steam page, you'll actually be able to see the history in which, uh, how long it took for the game to uh, be made. And right there, it says the total production time of the uh, the game is 17 days. Can you believe it? Character selection's pretty uh, pretty diverse, actually. Got a bunch of nice little outfits here. Things you can wear, you can wear a mask, you can go completely topless, whatever. You can be the dude in the hat. Doesn't really matter, you can also be a woman as well. You can do camo, you can do whatever you want, actually, for any of the these characters here. There's not as many character selections for the female character, it looks like. Maybe he was just having fun diversifying the dude. And then there's also <laughs> there's also bunnies you can be as well if you'd like to be. But we're going to start off, let's uh, let's pick a chick, actually. Let's be a chick on the first level. Let's do this one right here, and then let's get going to it. Pick your weapon of choice, of course. Uh, let's go with Scar, actually. Why not? And then we're going to do the highway first level here. Let's get to it here. 17 days. Chapter 1, Scavenger. 17 days it took to make this. This kind of blows my mind. All right, let's see if I can get through this without dying. Now, I have played this a little bit before, just a little, little bit. There's 30 zombies I got to kill on this level, so let's get to it here. Hello, zombies. Headshot. Headshots are really satisfying, by the way. Oh, that one's still alive. I hit the other one behind him. Can't get the headshot to save my life. More zombies coming. Let's reload here. Back up. They're going to be coming. These guys run, by the way. Oh, you got me. Okay, so my accuracy is pretty bad. <laughs> let's let's move on down the highway here, popping headshots wherever we can. Bow, just like that. Bow. Got that one too. Nope, that was a little low. There we go. Got him in the end. Oh, got him. One of them ducked. There it is. Yeah. Reload here while I can. I only got a uh, hundred or two hundred and thirty rounds left, so I, I mean that should be enough to finish off thirty zombies. You know, I don't know. My crosshairs were not even close on that one. Either. I still got it. Now there's a melee function also. You can run up and just what? -ah! Just beat up on the zombies. Boom! Double tap. All right. <laughs> Rule number what was that in Zombie Land? Rule number something. Double tap. You know. Headshots are awesome. I love the feeling. I love the sound effect you get when you get a headshot. Ding, done. Seven more zombies to go. Looks like they're in there. Six more zombies to go. Oh, there you go. Four more zombies. Anyone in here? Last zombie. Think. Got it. Bam. So that is the first level cleared. All right. So there's three levels in this game, so it's a pretty pretty short game, so this is going to be a whole entire video. But let's go back to the main menu there. Took out all the zombies there. And let's uh, let's uh, select a new character. Let's pick the dude. Going to go with this outfit here. Sure, why not? And then uh, let's uh, let's try this weapon is uh, here. We're going to try this out. We're going to do the village. Let's get to it. All right, so the village. It says Chapter 1 Scavenger again. I think it's Chapter 1 for all of them. But uh, it, uh, the village is like the medium level, so there's, uh, there's going to be more zombies on this one here. So, let's see. We got 50 zombies we got to clear. Let's see if we can't get some attention here. There's a zombie right there. Man, that's satisfying. Oh, got him. Oh, there's another one. Oh my gosh, is that nice. <laughs> you know, this game actually plays really smoothly, so I'm kind of impressed. I hear something. I hear him. I'm, I'm kind of scared. You can also pick up ammo. Okay, so I took a little bit of damage there. Not the greatest, but I got some ammo here. Got some more ammo. I think there's a flashlight also. There it is. Yeah, there. Bam. All right. I think I got everything in this house. Oop. 
pretty terrible accuracy on that one too. Man, I only got seven zombies. And I got hit twice. This is this is not a good start. Oh yeah, you can also switch the camera angle. I, I should probably do that. To look around corners a little bit closely. Mhm. Mm Satisfying. I see a zombie right there. Got him. I should probably get back to the street so I actually can have a clean line of sight on these things. That was a little nerve-wracking. Alright, there's a zombie right there. Got him. I wonder if I can just lure them out of the houses so I don't have to go in after them. Scary. I hear some upstairs. Just gonna have to go for it. Got him. Whew, alright. Zombies down. The music, the droning music is also something that's that's very unsettling. I gotta remember to melee more often too. Is there any ammo around here? Could use more ammo. Could always use more ammo. Oh, there's one right there in front of that garage. One right here too. Running out of that house. Let's reload while I can. There's another one in that doorway. Got him. Oh, I can't. I hit him a couple times. I think I got him. Alright, 31 zombies left. Let's do this. Oof, that was right in the, in the chin. Got him. Like I said, 17 days to make this. How awesome is that? Oh, light him up. Kind of came out of nowhere. I think I'm just luring them all out of that house. Oh. Got him. Zambies. Oh, I heard footsteps right behind me. <laughs> that got me a little, a little jumpy. Here we go. All right, what am I at? 19 zombies? Got him. Honestly, my accuracy at longer range is pretty bad. Now, I do need to check the rest of this house here, because I don't think I got them all. Grab some extra ammo, because I think I'm going to need that. Because my accuracy gets worse and worse from a greater range. All right, let's go check upstairs. Actually, let's check out back here real quick. All right, upstairs, let's do this. Mm. More ammo. Anything in here? Nothing in here? All right, let's go check up upstairs, the second floor, or third floor. Took them out, good. Whew, all right, I think this house is finally clear. I would like to make this my base of operation. Can you even imagine if this they made this into like a survival-based game? Oh man, that would be insane. Paid buku bucks for that one. Uh, but like I said, totally free game. So if you guys want to go do this fun and try to wipe out all the zombies, then you certainly can. Uh oh. Reload. Alright, eight zombies left. Matter of where are they? Ammo. I will gladly take. Let's check up here real quick. I think I might have got all these ones to run out of the building though, so I don't think I have to worry about it too much. You can actually jump in this game too. They did incorporate that, so if you get stuck on something, you can absolutely do that. I just heard one of them. All right, seven. Seven zombies is still going to be a little rough. Especially when they're hopping and skipping all over the place like that. Four zombies. 
Helps have a good pair of headphones so that you can hear where they're coming from. Let's get their attention. All right, there's uh, three zombies, is it? Yeah, there's one, two. Let's get this one over here before he sneaks up behind me. All right, two left. Oh, one's moving. One's coming down. Got him, last zombie. Let's go get him. Got him. Whoo, all right, zombies cleared. <laughs> so that was the medium level right there. Now, since the game released, I think they came out with another level, and we're gonna do that too on this video too, because why not? This time we're going full bunny on this one. We're gonna do the red rabbit. <laughs> uh, I like the scar a little bit better. I think that was a lot of fun. We're doing the Chinese alley. Now this is kind of interesting. All right, this one, uh, this one's got a lot more zombies in it. A lot more zombies. Ooh, again, 17 days. Not bad for 17 day development. Although I'm, if this was an update later, this one might have taken an additional time. I'm not sure. But still, this is awesome. All right, let's go, Red Rabbit. Let's go. There we go. Pick them off from a distance. Don't have to worry about them getting all up in my face then. Oh, I hit that. Come on. Bah! There he goes down. Wow, dog pile right there. Let's grab some ammo. Okay, getting those headshots. Um, I want to clear this alleyway, I think would be a good idea. It looks like there's multiple ways to go on this, though. So, peek around here. Uh-oh. Okay, that was a little rough. Not the greatest, most graceful. Let's see if I can't get that guy. Oh, he just doesn't care. All right, I'll pop him from here. Why not? All right, let's me go back down this way and make sure this area is clear. I have 80 zombies to clear here in this level, and there is... Well, there's a bunch of ammo right here. Sure, I'll take it. Absolutely. Yes, please. Uh, and there's 52 left to go. Fifty-one. Oh no, I think I killed two there. Anything over here? Nope. This is just a dead end over here. Grab the ammo though, gladly. Oh, they're going right there, running at me. Zombies in the alleyways. Let's grab the ammo again. Take these guys out from a distance. That way, they don't they don't get up on me. Like that. Use a lot more bullets when I do that, and I got a lot of zombies to kill. Did any of these guys notice or care? This one's hiding behind the fence. Oh, right in the dome. Saving on ammo. Ah, going fisticuffs with the zombie. Boom. Wow, man. This is like Wonder Woman. And double tap. <laughs> Alright, let's grab some more ammo. Now, I got 200 some rounds, so as long as I don't like miss every single one of my shots, I should be alright from here on out. I'm still going to grab every bit of ammo I can. Anyone down here? I've got 30 zombies hiding somewhere in this level still. There's some ammo down here. Worth it. Alright, the red bunny strikes again. Like, the design's nice. I like the red moon. The blood moon. Okay, music just changed. So if you guys play video games very often, you know, anytime there's a music change, it means you just entered a boss room. So let's uh, make sure I'm reloaded. There's ammo right there. Oh, there's zombies right here. No, I'm still up. Okay, he's dead. He was already wounded anyway. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Hurting unit. Red Rabbit almost went down there. Still got 20 more to go. Oh. Are they just going to keep filtering around this uh, corner here? Because I'll, I'll stand back. I 
chance. I kind of get a headshot. Right, headshot, headshot, headshot. There we go. Okay, 12 zombies to go. Whew. Oh, oh, there's one right there. Dang it. Ho, oh, oh. I, I don't. The bottom right has my health underneath my ammo there, and I am a hurting unit. There is no way to heal either. You gotta pass these levels or die trying. Okay, there's the last two zombies right there. Got him. And then this guy. Creepy. Uh, kind of makes me think that there might be a boss fight. But nope, that's it. <laughs> I'm guessing there's still more to go in this game. Three days later. Real quick, just after I made that entire video, uh, the game updated. That they added a boss to the end. The Chinese guy at the end is now a boss. They also added objectives to this level here as well. So I am back trying to knock this out. Now let's see if I can't clear these zombies quickly so that we can get onto the boss. Okay, now this is where the, the end of the level was before. We're supposed to get to right there. I'm going to go over here and clear out the rest of these zombies, though. All right, there we go. The rest of the zombies have been taken care of because I did try to bite, uh, beat this boss already earlier, and uh, it's very difficult. It's very difficult. You have to collect these uh, these tags, it looks like, before you can really do any damage to it. So I'm going to try to get the tag in front of it. I only got hit once clearing that area out, so that's a good thing. I'm going to try to collect the spell tag on this side. They're down the, at the end of every alleyway. So I'm going to try to grab that one, grab the one there, I'm going to take a lot of damage doing it, and then I'm going to try to kind of lure him and kite him around the diamond, and then I'm going to try to grab that last one. Let's see how this goes. There he is. Now you saw this at the end of the, at the, end of the first part of this video. This is new though. See, he like, he goes so fast. I need to grab the spell tag. Then I need him to not attack me. Yeah, I need to. I did reload. Okay, let's see. Uh, I gotta get this one right here too. Whew, whew, run, run, run. Get to the mailboxes at the end of the alleyway. Grabbed it. Got it. All right, now I gotta get around him again. Go, go, go. See, he teleports in front though. Like he's so fast. I don't know how to stop him. Look at that, he got me. All right, let's try that again. Oh, new death animations, by the way. Of course, the problem with retrying is you gotta start from scratch again. You gotta start right from the beginning. All right, second time's a charm. All right, I'll come back for this one. I'm actually going to just try to go for this uh, farther one here. I'm going to do the, the kite him around the diamond here, and then I'm going to try to get this one here and then get by him and get to that last one. Surprisingly fast for a zombie. Keep him on his toes there, doing some damage to him if I can. I don't know if I'm actually hurting him or not. I have actually collected these things all once before. But this this the one I'm going to be going for is quite a stretch here that I have to run to try to get there. And he's going to catch up to me, though. There it is. Got to grab it. Now I got to get that last one. So he's going to be right here. Ow. And see, if you don't stun him, a lot of times he catches right up to you by, like, teleporting right up to you. So, uh, I took, uh, half my health is gone now. I gotta get this last one. Then I gotta be able to do damage to him 
And I don't know if I have enough firepower to actually do that. I'm not sure how to actually beat this guy. I may, I'm guessing headshots. Let's grab this last one. Got the last one. All right, let's do some damage to him. Ow. Run, run, run. Let's get some distance from him and then try to turn around and do some... I got like one more hit on me and I'm done too. Hopefully he doesn't mind me constantly shooting him in the face. distance. I only got a uh, hundred and some rounds left. Hopefully I can finish this guy off. <laughs> only who oh, I'm running out of ammo. I wonder what happens if I do run completely out of ammo. Did I get him? Escape. Remaining zombies are about to strike. Okay, I think he's dead. I gotta get out of here. I do not have a lot of ammo. I make sure I know what the melee button is. Remaining zombies. I don't really have any remaining zombies. Oh, there's some ammo right there I missed. So, I wonder if the remaining zombies would actually leave me alone. Whew. Escape. Go, go, go. I've never actually gotten this far against this guy. I tried a couple times before I started recording. I wasn't able to get him that far. Go, 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 go. Run, run, run. And we have a winner. All right, so that's how you beat the boss that they just recently added. They just added that after I recorded the first part of this episode. So if you enjoyed this game or you think it looks like a lot of fun or you think you can do better than what I did because I only had one hit left, uh, go ahead and check it out on Steam. I love this concept. It's just a guy making a game <laughs> and then threw it up on Steam for free. So as far as the gameplay, I'd give it a really big thumbs up, actually. that's That was like a lot of fun. So if this gets more development time, I mean, more than 17 days, I think this will be a big hit. So if you guys did enjoy this video, please smash that like button and then check out this game on Steam. It's a lot of fun. Alrighty, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.